Praise the Lord and welcome back to the Trinity Channel live, Mubasha in the flesh, March 16th, the year of our Lord Jesus Christ, 2015. Here we are between programs and we have a 30-minute program that we're going to be talking about things going on here in the ministry, especially this uh, Trinity Channel International Apologetics Marathon. We're very excited here, uh, some 40 world-renowned speakers on this issue. We just finished a live program, uh, Why Coexist is Wrong, talking about uh, the ever-increasing malaise of pluralism uh, in the West and how it's uh, really undermining the biblical foundation of our faith here in the West and, of course, uh, how we need to be equipped to defend the faith. And we cannot be equipped without knowledge. The Word of God says, My people perish for a lack of knowledge. And here at the Trinity Channel, we are giving knowledge with a fire hose, if you will. And uh, so we pray that you are receiving and that you are being blessed by this ministry. And if you are being blessed, would you please let us know? If you can't give uh, money at this time, would you call us and encourage us? Let us know that you're watching. Let us know that you appreciate our efforts to preach the gospel, to stand for biblical truth, to expose uh, false religions and philosophies. We would love to hear from you. You can call us right now. We are live, 248 416-1300. You can email us at info at trinitychannel.com. Also, you can uh, snail mail us. We have our P.O. Box 724 up there, Walled Lake, Michigan. We'd love to hear from you. And I would just like to say and remind you that we have uh, two programs every night this week. And tonight we actually have three. Yours truly, Pastor Joseph, will be here for a late program news and views uh, and I know many of you would like to tune into that but our next program is going to be at 8.30 p.m. Eastern and it's going to be atheism and modern society. We'll talk about different issues like creation and evolution and many others. We're going to have some wonderful guest speakers. I pray that you'll tune in and let others know to do the same and indeed remind folks who are watching maybe some of you will watch or do watch regularly through the TCT uh, broadcast split four channel uh, well, these programs that are live tonight, the next few nights, will be rebroadcast through TCT in the next several days. So I pray you're being blessed. Here we are at the very beginning of the marathon. There's so much more to come. And it is a marathon, by the way, for our staff here at ABN, for our speakers. Have mercy on us. Join with us in this good work of the Lord. Join with us in prayer. Join with us in giving and receiving. For it's more blessed to give than to receive. Would you consider giving a generous gift to this ministry right now that we might stay on the air and continue to do what no one else is doing in this world today, consistently speaking the truth about false religions like Islam and consistently contrasting that with a pure, undefiled religion, the gospel of Jesus Christ. For it alone has the power of salvation. Now I'd like to turn to the co-founder of uh, the ministry of ABN, the Trinity Channel, uh, Sister Haifa Goria. Thank you, Pastor Joseph. Thank you very much. And we are really blessed to have you here with us in ABN and the Trinity Channel. And uh, welcome our viewers everywhere, wherever you are watching ABN and the Trinity Channel. We welcome you in the name of Jesus. And we are excited. Are you excited? We want you to be, to be excited and expecting great things from this week, this week of International Apologetic Week of a marathon, two to three live talk shows every day. We, uh, we expanded uh, our speakers, our guests, our <laughs> mission. And as you see from the emails we were sending and from what you are going to see, there are other ministries, other missions, uh, other people, other guests that they are, they joined ABN and the Trinity Channel in order to, to have varieties of programs, to have varieties to, um, uh, of, of our guests and topics in order to defend our faith and also most, most, uh, most important is to declare the truth that is in uh, the name of Jesus, that is uh, the salvation through the blood of Christ. And, 
And here at the Trinity Channel, we, we would like to say we are excited for this week. You will see uh, all our programs. You will see all the different kind of topics which Basim is going to share also. I think in his welcoming, he mentioned some of them. And we want to see how the Lord is expanding the ministry. It is his ministry. It is he planted those seeds. And he is letting those seeds to grow and to grow. And many are coming to the knowledge of Jesus Christ and to accept him as Lord and Savior. It is a blessing to work in the vineyard of the Lord. And we can see the fruit. Uh, we want you to join us to partner in your prayer and in your support to reach out millions for, uh, for Christ. And uh, we will talk more, but I will, uh, I will hand uh, the microphone to uh, Basim, who is the founder of ABN. And it was a blessing for both of us to start this ministry. Basim, would you like to uh, say something for our yes. viewer? Yes. Welcome. Thank you, Rizma. And thank you, Pastor Joseph. Thank you, everyone, for watching yeah. the Trinity Channel. And especially, this is the first day of the Marathon International Apologetic Marathon Week. And uh, we are excited uh, to have this kind of marathons uh, nowadays. And we have planned to increase the, these marathons. And the next one will be in about two months. And it's going to be for two full weeks. So we have another like four to five um, uh, events, big events like this. Um, every, every time or every uh, marathon, we are inviting some renowned about 40, 30 to 40 great speakers from different seminaries, different colleges, different universities. And uh, in this one, we invited almost 40 between speakers and hosts. And today is the first day. And uh, we are excited that uh, this is a great celebration. We have chosen uh, numerous uh, topics about apologetics uh, we, from, uh, to other religions or false religions, false ideologies, false doctrines. And uh, as, we, as some of you have seen just the previous show that was uh, the first show about why coexist is wrong, this is another ideology of plur pluralism in the West, which is increasing. And this, uh, uh, it's not just doctrine, or it's not just ideology, but it is a deception and a threat to Christianity, a threat to the church. And that's why we see young people from the church are leaving the faith. And why? Because of the ignorance of the, of the uh, tr truth, about the truth of the Bible. And also, there's another uh, issue that the speakers, they mention about this issue of coexist, is that about the public schools. So before I want to continue, I just want to read one verse from uh, John chapter 14, where Jesus talked about that there is no other way because he is the way, the truth, and the life. And Thomas, chapter 14, verse 5, Thomas said to Jesus, Lord, we do not know where you are going, so how can we know the way? Jesus answered, I am the way and the truth and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. No one comes to the, to the Father except through me. And this idea of pluralism and uh, coexist, that is just another deception, another weeds from the Satan, from the enemy. Jesus said, no one comes to the Father except through me, through Jesus. So this channel, as you see, um, uh, um, the, the Trinity channel, this is a unique channel. Why it's a unique channel? Because all other media, you see that they do not speak the truth. They, there is some like um, uh, political correctness, some issues. Even in the church today, we see some of the churches that uh, 
they are um, mixing between religions, accepting um, Islam. They think like Islam and uh, Judaism and uh, Christianity and Hinduism and Sikhism all are nearly the same God. We worship the same God. It's not true. Actually, the Moses of the Bible is different from the Moses of Quran. The Noah of the Bible is not the same Noah of Quran. Um, the, the Baptist of the Bible is different totally from the Baptist of Quran. Jesus of the Bible is not totally different Jesus of the Quran. The Holy Spirit of the Bible is considered um, Angel Gabriel in the Quran. So everything is wrong. Everything is different. But the problem is we have ignorance in our churches. But also there's another issue is we need to repent and to go back to God. Why? Because some of the churches today, we are believing and accepting the issue of uh, abortion and homosexuality. And that is what, why other religions are flourishing, why are becoming much stronger, because the church has uh, shrinked back. The church is dying. And we need you to support this channel, Trinity Channel, in order to continue to be able to present the truth of God, to defend the truth in this fallen society, in these last days. And please uh, call us now if you uh, pick up the phone, the, um, the, the telephone 248, call us at 248-416-1300, or you may go to the website abnsat.com or www.trinitychannel.com or send us an email at info at trinitychannel.com. We have uh, numerous programs on so many other um, uh, platforms like YouTube. We have a great uh, um, uh, channels like Trinity Channel at YouTube. If you go to YouTube, you see all these kind of programs on uh, our channel, which is called Trinity Channel. If you just type Trinity Channel in YouTube, you will have all these uh, programs. So um, the issue uh, of what's happening about this, um, this is one of the deception of the enemy, uh, the issue of coexist. But through this week, we're going to have a lot of other topics uh, whether about heresies, about Mormons, Jehovah's Witnesses, about Islam, about terrorism, about ISIS, about uh, atheism, about science and faith. Please stay tuned and tell others to watch the Trinity Channel. We're going to have every day two shows, every night two shows at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and uh, 8.30 p.m., from 6 to 7.30, and from 8.30 until 10 o'clock. However, tonight and tomorrow, Monday and Tuesday, Pastor Joseph is here, so we will have the third show from 10.30 to 12.30 with Pastor Joseph on the program um, News and Views. Now I will have... Uh, uh, I will give the microphone to Haifa, and then I will come back uh, after the break. Thank you, Basim. Thank you for giving also a summary about the programs that we, we just had with Pastor Joseph, with his guest. And we are anticipating more, more varieties, more programs, more topics. And I want just to say uh, uh, a few of those, uh, of, the, of those topics. They are all very, uh, very good uh, kind of a debate, and to see how you will learn from it. And some, some of them, uh, they are like uh, Islam, Islam's violation of human rights, how holy and just is the God of Islam, uh, the value of a female in Islam, uh, ex exposing today's uh, heresies and uh, about world religion. So we will have many topics. Just stay tuned and call your friends, your neighbor, Whoever you want, you, you want them to be blessed with those programs and to know. And we receive lots of feedback about, about the programs that we, um, 
we have that people really, they are hungry to know, they wanted to know, they, they are benefiting a lot from knowing about, about other religion, if it is Islam or, or, or the debate night or other things. So, so it is kind of, uh, the West needs to know, need to be, uh, to, to wake up and to know what's happening around the world and uh, in, in, the, in, in what's happening in, through ISIS or through other things. Now, I want to, um, I want just to uh, read one or two verses from Roman 10, 14, and then we'll continue. Uh, this is, uh, um, it says that in uh, verse 14, how then can they call on the one they have not believed in? And how can they believe in the one of whom they have not heard? And how can they hear without someone preaching to them? And, and how can anyone preach unless they are sent? Unless they are sent. And here, ABN and the Trinity Channel, it is a mission that, that is sent, that th the seed of this mission is planted by God. And who sent this mission? It is people like you and other churches and others who are really on their heart to reach out to the world with the message of Christ and to, to see how, how the devil is trying to, to confuse people, to try to hide the truth, to try to uh, kill. And Jesus said, I come to give life but, and life in ab abundance. And here, in the Trinity Channel and ABN, we want to, to declare that there is life and life in abundance only through Jesus Christ, our Lord. And uh, that's why we see, as in this uh, marathon, we expanded, uh, we expanded our topics and, and our guests to have 30, 40, 40 people and ministries. They are joining us. And as Basin mentioned, like some of them, the Prob Ministry, uh, Creation Research Society, Ratio Christi, Christian Apologist, um, uh, Christian Defense, Angel Down Answers, Creation Research Society, Spring Arbor University, all those they have Christian Action Network, Council of Ex-Muslims of Morocco, and so on. All those ministries, all those apologists, they see the importance of reaching out the world with the message of salvation through media because nowadays media they have a big impact because they it, it is reaching out to not only hundreds or thousands but millions of people and as you see ABN and the Trinity Channel we have different platforms it is not only it is through dish and it is through uh, through the web streaming the six channels through web streaming in the internet through YouTube uh, through also a TCT network we, we have programs also, they go to Australia and, and in New Zealand. And uh, so, um, Roku, IPTV boxes. So, we are trying to expand in many dimensions as the Lord guide us and help us. And we want you also to uh, partner and to give us a helping hand. If the Lord is speaking to you and you are seeing how important are those programs to educate people, to see how how the message of salvation is going powerfully to people in from from different backgrounds we we are not reaching out only to one one uh, background people but to different backgrounds even for those christian who are a new believers those programs uh, it is just like helping them to stand firm in their faith and deepening their their root in the Bible. So we would love uh, for you please to partner with us and pray for our ministry so we will be able to, to have uh, more, more people to be in the studio to do more production and more on-air production. Give us a call at 248-416-1300 or email us abn at abnsat or through the Trinity Channel all, or uh, go to our website and you can make make your donation through abnsat.com or trinitychannel.com. Thank you, and I will uh, we'll take a break now, and we'll come back to you for to continue this, uh, this break of half an hour. Stay tuned with us.